Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to deploy control for advanced financial controls using Oracle Application Cloud. So first we sign into the account using our credentials. Once we sign in, then from the dashboard, we will click on the very first icon, which is Risk Management Advanced Controls. And from there, we will click on the Advanced Controls. So this icon is basically used for AFC and AAC. On the Controls page, we will click on the Action drop-down list from which we will select the first option, which is Deploy Transaction Controls. So we will use this option for deploying the AFC module. So now I'm going to deploy a module, which is uh, deploy a control, which is duplicate table invoice. So I will select this record name this model and then I'll click on the next option. So now I'll set the priority as one. One means the most priority and then the result type incidence. This is the model name. Now I will click on the next option. In the next step, we can choose a perspective hierarchy model also for the result perspective assignment. So we won't choose any of this for this session. So next, in the next step, we can assign uh, an user for the control security assignment. So I'm going to assign a user who can uh, edit or be the owner or be the viewer of this control. So I will choose a username Shreya and I will authorize her as the editor. Now I will save the detail and then we can move on to the next step. Now this is the result security assignment. This person can edit the result or the outcome of the control. So I will choose um, uh, one user, Firas Ahmed, and I will authorize him as the editor as well. And then I'll click on the save option. Now we will go to the next option, which is work list assignment. So the result investigators are all eligible users, or we can search individual names. So we will choose all eligible users. Now we will proceed to the next step, which is related record. Now this is the part where we connect financial reporting appliance to advanced financial control. So here we can add risk control or process from the FRC module that has been created earlier. So for this test uh, control deploying, I'm not going to add any FRC module here. So I will just proceed to the next step. Now this is the review part where we can review all the details that we have put in the previous steps. So first is the name, the status, priority, result type, and then the control perspective assignment, result perspective assignment, these we haven't signed anyone. Any, any perspective, and then the control security assignment where we have assigned Shreya, and then the result security assignment where we have added Firas and also the other details. Now we can submit the control. Now from the control page, we're going to look for the control that we have just created. So this is the control that I've just created. So now I'm going to run this control from action drop down list. I'm going to select the run option.
so the job was submitted now we can quickly go to the monitor jobs to check whether it has completed so we can see the record name has been queued now we can refresh the page for it to complete so after refreshing this page a few times the job has completed now we can go back and check for any incident number so now we look for the control that we have just ran so this was the control that we have just ran and it has no result count which means this this doesn't have any incidents count to it so this is how we can deploy control review the control and run the control using the oracle application cloud for advanced financial controls thank you so much for watching the video